You know what my dad told me last night? He said that you got a full ride to Kansas. You just quit. Why? My father didn't like me very much. And someone told him I was good at basketball. And he paid a lot more attention to me. And I realized it wasn't me that he loved. It was what I could do. I spent a lot of time hurting myself, trying to hurt my father. I never picked up a basketball again. I need a new coach, Jack. You're the first person I thought of. The team any good? No. <laughs> In fact, the last time they made the playoffs, back when you were playing. It's the whole team, 10 kids. I want to know why they're leaving you open. It's because they don't think you could hit the ocean from the beach. Oh, snap. Heard you're coaching basketball. Just my mind off other things. You don't decide the game. The players decide the game. I understand you're trying to motivate the team, but we have a code of conduct. Oh, oh shit. I'm working on it. Work harder. Like, this team is not as bad as its record. We have to trust each other. We have to have faith. I just want you to be happy again. But you gotta want it too. Don't underestimate the impact you can have on them. You got this. No, don't just nod. I want to hear your voice. Yes or no? Yes, coach. You're nervous. I get it. The truth is, they're more talented than you. Probably got a better coach. But I promise you, they are not a better team. Because they haven't been through what we've been through. They don't know adversity. They don't know what it's like to get knocked down, to have to get back up again. They don't know what it is to fight. Who are we? Hey! 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 We can't change the past, Jack. What we can do is choose how we move forward. Are you a princess? Maybe. Really? Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Oh, Prince Super Charming is back. Yeah. It's happening. This is recording now, and we'll be recording the whole time. Oslo was a convicted felon. He is also an informant for the Federal Bureau of Investigation. We have a buyer. I'm gonna take everything you got, Cotto. You're a cop. These guys find out you're a cop, you're a dead man, you understand? I'm gonna give you one chance. And I'm gonna give it to you in a few seconds. No, freeze! That's where I can see him, NYPD! This is bad business. Strozek tells me that the cop was pointing the gun in your face. You now owe the price of your life to Void Tech. How much is your life worth? You'll break your parole. Go back to prison. If anyone can get drugs inside, it's you. I want out. We go along with the general's plan. Evidence of fentanyl being methodically distributed inside a state prison buries the general for good. And if that happens, you're a free man. If you go back inside, you'll never get out. I'm here to investigate the death of somebody very close to me. We can't have this detective find out that an FBI informant was present during the murder of one of his own. You want to pitch your field office against the biggest police department in the world? You love us a good fight. Vendetta on my mind like a sick pleasure. What are you thinking? Burn him. He has a family. We looked him in the eyes. We made him guarantees. I don't have kids. I would suffer too much if something happened to him. He's starting to come back home. I'm scared. I'm doing everything I can. I'm coming for payback. I'm coming for payback. I'm the hangman. And I just put a tight noose around your neck. I'm coming for payback. I'm not getting out of this. This ends now. Surprise. What is happening? What is all of this? Did you see that article? 
every year these liberal elites kidnap a bunch of normal folks like us and hunt us for sport. The last I heard, free speech still exists. Don't First Amendment me. It wasn't real. Everybody get out of here! We were joking. If there's been a killing spree, you gotta come here right now. You actually believed we were hunting human beings for sport. <laughs> but you are. We have an opportunity here to teach these people. These are not real people. They're actors. I'm playing an Arab refugee, but I identify as white. I think that's problematic too, in some way. You wanted it to be real, so you decided it was. What kind of sick people would even think of something like that? White people. We're the worst. I'm just not that good with people. But there is one thing I'm good at. The mission was to find out what they knew, but that's kind of difficult now that you killed everyone. I just don't think you're cut out for the intelligence. This is your last shot. How's school going? Oh my god. You have jelly all over your face. I'm definitely posting that on Insta. Is it too late to homeschool me? Are you CIA? How'd you get in here? Oh, okay, she has a camera. She might be streaming. If Kim finds out we got made by a nine-year-old, my career's over. What's the option? Kill her. Make it look like an accident. Yeah, maybe the stairs. What? Wow, still recording. We can cut a deal. I want you to teach me how to be a spy. But just to be clear, this is a one-time arrangement. Never again. I can't promise. So what's first? Shooting range, obstacle course? Or I had to walk away from an explosion? A lie detector test. I can smell a lie. Endorphins release an odor, and the ultimate tell, the slightest blink of an eye. You mean like this? JJ, I admire all of your tattoos. Stop. JJ, I believe you that you've never taken steroids. Damn, she's good. When you look out there, what do you see? 90 civilians, minimal security, soft perimeter. Smiling people having fun. You should try it sometime. My team. <laughs> The objective of this exercise is to get past me. A good idea might be to cause a distraction, because otherwise there'd be zero chance that you get. Oh, Blueberry! Under the rough exterior. <laughs> You're a nice guy. <laughs> what is he doing? This looks like the wedding at the end of Shrek. I just wanna break the rules. Aww.
why it came all the way up here. There's nothing left. Please. There are people out there worth saving. <laughs> Six of our northern cities have fallen in a coordinated attack. Their leader fights alongside a witch. Crush these murderers. Your Majesty. Every family must contribute one man to fight. You're a war hero. You've already made many great sacrifices. My father cannot fight, so I will take his place. The Northern invaders will kill her. If I expose her, our own people will kill her. When we take the Imperial City, I will take revenge for my father. What is your name, soldier? Hua Jun, Commander. Son of Hua Zhou. You will now take the oath of the warrior. Loyal. Loyal. Brave. Brave. True. True. Release! You will die pretending to be something you are not. Yet here I stand. Proof that there is a place for people like us. A girl threatens all plans. A warrior. And initiate sequence. Sorry to be the one to tell you this, but you got yourself killed at RST. We'd rebuild the most important assets in the US military. Soldiers like yourself. You're the first who we've successfully managed to bring back, but improved, enhanced. With the technology in your veins, you have an army inside you that will not only make you stronger, it will heal you instantly. Holy shit. Now tell me, do you remember anything? Where are you going? I've got unfinished business. I'm gonna find the man who murdered my wife and kill him. Oh, that's not good. All right, shut him down. And initiate sequence. Okay, who is the next target for elimination? Tell me, do you remember anything? Do I know you guys? I don't think so. <laughs> They've been manipulating you. What you think is real. Sometimes ain't. And initiate sequence. about men like me.
That is absolutely fantastic. I feel like I just heard this. Are they playing this on repeat? You know, my dad told me last night, he said that you got a full ride to Kansas. You just quit. Why? My father didn't like me very much. And someone told him I was good at basketball. And he paid a lot more attention to me. And I realized it wasn't me that he loved. It was what I could do. I spent a lot of time hurting myself, trying to hurt my father. I never picked up a basketball again. I need a new coach, Jack. You're the first person I thought of. Is the team any good? No. <laughs> In fact, the last time they made the playoffs, back when you were playing. It's the whole team, 10 kids. You wanna know why they're leaving you open? It's because they don't think you could hit the ocean from the beach. Oh, oh snap. Heard your coaching basketball. Keeps my mind off other things. You don't decide the game, the players decide the game. I understand you're trying to motivate the team, but we have a code of conduct. Oh, no! oh shit. I'm working on it. Work harder. I got a feeling this team is not as bad as its record. We have to trust each other. We have to have faith. I just want you to be happy again. But you kind of want it too. Don't underestimate the impact you can have on them. You got this. No, don't just nod. I want to hear your voice. Yes or no? Yes, coach. You're nervous. I get it. The truth is, they're more talented than you. Probably got a better coach. But I promise you, they are not a better team. Because they haven't been through what we've been through. They don't know adversity. They don't know what it's like to get knocked down and have to get back up again. They don't know what it is to fight. Who are we? Hey! We can't change the past, Jack. What we can do is choose how we move forward.